Today on The Blind Pig, I'm gonna show you how to make the Baby Guinness and the Mini Beer Shots. Hey everyone, welcome back once again to The Blind Pig. As always, I'm your host, Jason. Usually when I make these videos, I spend some time on the internet researching the origins of a cocktail and give it to you in my own words. For the Mini Beer Shot, however, I couldn't find anything for the origin story. In the case of the Baby Guinness, I don't think I could possibly say it any better than what I found on Wikipedia. I'm just gonna read it to you directly. The famous Baby Guinness shot is believed to have originated in Dublin during the 1980s and early 1990s. Its roots can be traced back to a bar, now closed, called the Waxy Dargy, hope I pronounced that right, located next to the Rotunda Maternity Hospital. The bar brewed its own Irish coffee liquor and became a tradition to offer expectant and new mothers and fathers a complimentary Baby Guinness shot with coffee liqueur and Baileys alongside a pint of real Guinness. This has continued in Irish pubs to this day. Both these shots are super simple to make. Let me show you how. For the mini beer, uh, we start with about two thirds of our glass. We have these cool little uh, mini beer glasses. Thought they'd work well for what we're doing. Two thirds, maybe more like three quarters of the way up uh, with liquor 43. We're gonna make these both simultaneously here. Uh, for our baby Guinness, we wanna do about the same ratio, uh, maybe a little less of uh, this than liquor 43. Uh, any coffee liqueur will work. We love Mr. Black, so we featured it quite a bit. We're gonna use that one for this as well. Now, for both these drinks, the next ingredient kind of simulates the head on the beer. Uh, in the case of the uh, mini beer, we're actually gonna use heavy whipping cream. And we try to pour it over the back of a spoon. The idea is that this will layer on top and look as though we have the head of a beer. I'm very happy with the way that came out. And then for our Baby Guinness, we do the same thing, only this time with Baileys. It's a cream, we're just gonna reuse the spoon here. Not quite as pretty on that one. It will settle if I let it. You can see it's starting to settle already. Either way, let's go ahead, give them a shot. Literally. First, our mini beer featuring Liquor 43 and Heavy Cream. Cheers. Tastes nothing like a beer, but what it does taste is delicious. There's probably a lot of calories in this, not something you wanna drink maybe nine or 10 of it a night, but you definitely could, because they're very good. Oh, that goes down so nicely. You can see it did start to settle a little bit. Uh, again, the idea is that it looks like the head of a beer on top. Really, it's all in the flavor though. Uh, this one I know is good, I've had quite a few of these. This is our baby Guinness, cheers. Delicious cocktail. Bailey's and coffee liqueur go well together, go so well together, it makes for a great shot. Both these are delicious, highly recommend. I love them both, uh, I can't even say which one I like more. Maybe, as you can see, I get less of our liquor 43 in the bottle, because we've drank a lot of these in the past. That might be my slight edge. Both these are delicious though, go ahead and give a shot at home guys, super easy to make. Thanks for watching the video, please subscribe, like the video, leave a comment below. We'll see you soon, cheers. One more please stop. time. Please stop. To read this direct quote. The famous Baby Guinness shot is believed to have originated in Dublin. I fucked it.